Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Barbara. If you're new here, welcome. Thank you for joining the family or clicking on the video. Uh, if you're returning, hey, nice to see you guys again. Um, if you would be so kind as to take a moment to go down there and hit that subscribe button and the post notification bell next to it and help me grow my channel. That's my goal for this year, to grow it and to be more consistent so do me a favor and go ahead and do that for me if you wouldn't mind it is free it doesn't cost you anything and i would appreciate it i'm here to show you guys my timu haul this one was sent to me for review so if you're interested to see what's in this bag just stay tuned okay here we go i am going to just cut this on open and hopefully I can cut it open where I don't mess something else up. Let's see what I picked. I got to choose, I think, eight items. And yeah, they sent it to me for free just to take a look at it and see if I like it. So let's go ahead and open the box. I did try and find the order so I could give you prices, but I couldn't find it. So I'm sorry about that, guys. First thing I'm pulling out is what we got in here i did receive this pretty quickly it was oh god not even five days and i had it so i got this you guys know me and my obsession with clear plastic acrylic containers so i got this um I am going to use this to put my Young Nails um, gels in, the, like the base gels and the hard gels and stuff like that. It, up. it does feel like a standard organizer. It doesn't feel cheap. And you know, I will always be 100 with you because you are my primary concern. Okay. And we have three, six, nine, twelve little boxes. That's what they look like. I think that'll be the perfect size for the gels to stick with all of my other nail supplies in my closet. So there you go, there's that. See what I pull out next. I feel another box. Oh, this is cute. These are a little set of four acrylic organizers. You know how I am. If you've been here a while, you know that I have an issue with the organizers. These are four little acrylic organizers that I plan on using for cotton rounds, Q-tips, anything like that, that you can um, put a cover on and keep from getting dusty. Because I live in Arizona and everything is full of dust here. And I saw these and I had to have them. They feel pretty decent. They don't feel cheap or um, flimsy. It's pretty hard. So hopefully that means that they will stand up to the test of time. But based on what I've seen from Timo in the past, I have good expectations for them. I don't have the receipt, so I don't have the price. And let's see. Still something big. What is this? Oh, yeah. It's that stamp. It is not drying. Ah, where are you? Oh, this is a... Um, car seat cover set for my car. 
And this was a set of four. And I think it was like 15 bucks. I don't recall to the penny, but um, it does have a stink to it though. But I'm sure that'll come out. It's like that new packaging smell. So it's not bad. I'm sure over time it will wear out, wear off. And there is a set of four, the two front seats and the back seat. So I'm excited to put those in my car and see how they work. See how it's supposed to be universal. Let me see if it fits my car. I do try and be mindful and get things that I know that I can use and that won't go to waste. Um, because one of my biggest things is I hate waste, hate waste. And then we got this for the doggies. I have a Oliver, you know, if you've been a while, you've seen my little buddy Oliver, but he is a toy poodle and he is a very high maintenance dog. He always have, I groom him myself. I don't take him to be groomed. It is a little scrubber brush for when I'm giving him a bath. So I can scrub his little fur nice and clean because doing it with my hands just isn't enough. And it feels like there's a hard core in there. What is in there? Ah, oh, maybe you can put shampoo in there and help wash the dog. And he's got a cute little face on him. I think that's what that is for. And look at that adorable face. So I'm going to use this to scrub my doggies. And my daughter also has, well, he's not so small anymore, even though he's only like nine weeks old, 10 weeks old. But she has a chocolate lab staffy mix so we can use that for him and i also have a min pin chihuahua um mix and she is a old girl so i can use that for her she's very short haired this is a one two three four five piece wooden spatula set again for my kitchen i do have non-stick pans and so I use either wood or plastic. I don't use metal because it scratches up the pins. So, ooh, these are nice and heavy. I like that shine. Nice, 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 nice. And I actually do have a serving bowl that's wooden just like this, so it will look perfect. And then we got these two here. So I'm excited to give these a try. I have bought a lot of things from Timu for my kitchen, for the bathrooms. I do have some makeup that you guys suggested I try out that I will do on a get ready with me so you can see that, see how it applies. For myself, I am going to be 57 years old next month. And skin, things don't work on my skin like they work on younger ladies, uh, 30s, 40s. It's different when you're almost 60. So I'm excited to see how that type of makeup works on skin like mine for a mature woman. I do have pretty decent skin. Um, I do have wrinkles and crinkles and I do have bags and all that stuff that comes along with aging, but um, for the most part, I do okay with most um, cosmetics, except for foundation. I'm very picky with foundation. So moving along, next I got this little baster, random colors is what it says. Does it give it, it says oil brush random color. Let's 
I bought this for um, the grill. Like when you're doing barbecue outside and you gotta baste your meat, you can use that for the grill. You can use that to just um, marinate meat, do whatever you need to eat, a little spatula for. So. And then I got something else for my doggies. This is a collapsible bowl for my dogs. So when you take them out for a walk, you can simply throw this in your purse or your bag or wherever, and you have a bowl to give your dogs water. And I live in Arizona. So it's very important here, especially in the summer months, to make sure that you hydrate yourself and your animals if they're with you. So that is exciting. I'm happy to have that. I'm excited to give that a try and see how it works out. And then the very last item I got to try out was this five-piece crystal set. I do like wire wrapping and stuff like that. So we'll see how the crystals work out. They're supposed to be healing crystals. Now, I don't know a whole lot about that stuff. Um, but if you guys want to educate me, I'd be happy to read it. Always up for learning new things. And this is the five-piece set. They are... Pretty. They're like a gray, gray and black type crystal. And they are not a bead, they are just crystals. So maybe I will wrap them in some wire and wear them, or I don't know. Any healing anything would be good for me so and that's how i got these things on my hand these scars from my wire wrapping practice stuff so that's why i bought these and that's it um overall i'm happy I, i'm happy to try these out i'm grateful for timu sending them to me to try I will let you guys know what I think of them. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what else you'd like to see. I do have another uh, Timu haul that I haven't opened yet. I'll probably do that tomorrow, but that's a comparison between um, Timu was having a 99 cent sale and I have a, an order from Shop Miss A that I still haven't opened, but the, both of those around are around the same type of thing they're both like dollar store stuff and i got some comments that timu was like wish and that there's poor quality and um that's not anything that i've experienced but now i have actually something from timu and their dollar line and i have shop miss a so i can compare the two and that's just strictly for my own information. And yeah. And I think that's about it. I'm rambling now, aren't I? It's like 11 o'clock at night and I'm tired. But I wanted to get these up for you. So I hope you enjoyed this little tiny video. Uh, what else? Subscribe to my channel. Hit the post notification bell. Um, share my video. Give me a like. That would be great. That tells YouTube that you liked it and uh, will help them push it into the algorithm. And that being said, like I say in every single video, be safe, be kind, and love one another. And I will see you guys in my very next video. Bye!